Serving here in Youngstown, it's about the people. If you walk around and you drive around, you can see all the abandoned houses and they've been stripped of all their, you know, copper. And, uh, but, you know, you walk through these neighborhoods and there, there are lives there. In Youngstown, Ohio, there are two cores, Youngstown Citadel and Youngstown Temple. Six months ago, they merged into one facility, sharing one building and operating as one army. When I first got here to Youngstown, um, one of my first Sunday school, I came into the chapel. I had this wonderful Sunday school uh, planned out and there were three children sitting here and all three of them were my children. And I went back into my office and I just cried because we have a community out there of kids and I just knew that we couldn't settle for that. From then on, I just started, every time I saw a kid, I would go out into the parking lot and invite them in and um, tell them that we had Sunday school here and that's how we started to get kids. And we started picking them up for Sunday school and from there we decided that we would start doing Girl Guard, Sunbeams and Boys Adventure and at that point, uh, Temple Core was merging in to the Youngstown Citadel's uh, Mahoney County building, and so we decided let's work together. The Youngstown Temple Core is specifically um, geared towards ministry to the Hispanics. Completely agreed with the with the idea of moving into the Glenwood building. The first time I walked through here and I could see all the different classrooms and and could see the chapel, I said this is a place where we can grow, and this is a place where. Um, we can expand and the children could broaden their horizons. One of the things that we try to do to help bridge the gap between two churches, I will say Citadel and Temple are two very different churches in many aspects, um, is that every two months we will get together and have a bilingual service. Just seeing the way the children's program has exploded. I don't know how many children will be here today, but I've seen weeks where we've had 75 kids, 80 kids here, and not because they're obligated to be here, but because they know they're loved and they're accepted here. God is definitely blessing us here, but one common thing we have found is everybody needs to be loved, and love is a universal language. That when we communicate, when we work together, things just become amazing here. And just in the short time of these six months, I've seen things that have completely blown me away. You know, the scripture tells us that we are to be one body in Christ. You know, whether it be Mahoning County, whether it be Youngstown Temple or Youngstown Citadel, that we'd be here together as one body in Christ, serving one Lord, one Savior, reaching out to those in our community. All that you